Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's me, Star I'm Minerva, and in this video, I'll be talking about how I got my fluency in English. If you know me in person, you might notice that I'm not good at speaking, but you might have noticed that I am improving, right? I don't want to make this video long, so let's get right into the video. Okay, speaking a language requires three major things, a good vocabulary, confidence, and fluency. You don't have to use the words as cessation, lavish, gigantic, euphoria, tardiness, behold, etc. Leave them to the writers and use simple words for conversations. And by the confidence, if you know you are right and know what else matters, you know you got the confidence. So speak your heart out. Now let's talk about how to achieve the fluency. I have improved a lot by following these steps, so I want to discuss some of them with you. Read. Reading helps the most when you try to be fluent in any language. And most of us read in our minds and that's kind of relaxing. But if you read for at least 7 to 10 minutes, use the difference. Listen. You should listen to native English speakers to get the idea how to pronounce the words. You can watch American YouTubers to learn certain phrases they use in their sentences. Think in English. This one is hard, even I couldn't do that, but this helps a lot. When you're thinking about something, just translate the words and think about that in English. And not in other languages because there is no way you're gonna forget your mother tongue. Talk to yourself. I always thought that talking to myself is weird and people might think I'm crazy, but now I talk to myself 24-7 and I enjoy it. When you have no one to talk to, you can talk to yourself and you can talk about literally anything to yourself and no one's gonna judge you. Please make sure that there is no one around you or they might think you're crazy. Use text to speech. Do you know that there is a little mic along with your Gboard and if you click on it and say something, it will automatically type it for you and that's great for practicing. Record your voice in English every week and at the end of the month, you'll see how much you have improved. Make some friends. Make some friends you can talk in English with and you can have daily conversation and every time you speak you'll get better. Describe a picture. Look at this picture over here and describe it. You can make up stories or you can simply talk about whatever is going on inside it. Like what is he doing? What is he thinking about? Search it up. If you don't know the meaning of certain words, you can simply search it on the internet and see the meaning of it and there will be a speaking icon and if you click on it, you can listen to how the word is pronounced. And if you know phonetics is good for you, you can read it directly. I guess I made myself clear and there's nothing else to talk about. If you learned something from this video, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already i am on instagram and twitter so go and follow me there and mm, and if i have missed some points that i should have included in this video please let me know in the comments keep practicing and i'll see you guys in the next video next week next saturday until then peace